Hey, what is going on YouTube? It's DJ Wacky and yeah guys, I'm back with another Funko Pop review now Just gonna quickly apologize because you might hear some background music. That ain't me. That ain't this video That's just my neighbors. So I'm gonna quickly say sorry if you can hear that But either way guys, you know what you're over here to check out another Funko Pop So this time round something a bit more I thought be a, I guess in a good price range because the kind of the Funko Pops that I've gone for some people might be like oh that's a bit much and other than that, some people might appreciate original authenticity. So yeah, this is the original Human Torch celebrating 80 years of Marvel Comics. Now that is an amazing achievement over there as well. Obviously Marvel is the huge industry that it is now, especially in the entertainment world. You can see over there, they're giving it a nice good cover. Now, obviously we'll go ahead, check out the box and see how this turns out. And then afterwards we'll unbox it. It's got a good bobblehead figure, so I'll we'll get that on the 360 rotating table so you can have a bit more in-depth look. But yeah, let's go ahead and check it out. And here we have it, guys. This is the box for the original Human Torch. Now, I would say this only retails around uh, about £5, so literally it is quite cheap. I'm not sure what that would be in US dollars, but either way, guys, it is quite a um, unique box, I would say, because of the silver, very bright silver pattern logo over there, and plus... A bobblehead figure for it to be this cheap isn't um, usual, so I would say they've, it is worth going ahead and just getting it just for your collection because at the end of the day, it's celebrating uh, Marvel's 80 years of their achievements overall. And um, again, we've got the issue over there, 501, so Marvel's got a lot of collections. What I would say, there are a couple of Funko Pops, obviously, in this collection, but rather than showing um, the different types of Funkos, you can get what they normally do in the back. They've gone for the original comic book in which the Human Torch did first appear in. So, obviously, I don't know the year, but this is way before my time. Um, I could tell you that much. And one thing I do appreciate, because I do read a few comic books now and then, you notice, obviously, the difference. There's no real facial feature on the original Human, um, on the, uh, human Torch. And that is because... Back then, um, comic books were, of course, all cartoonish. They were very simply drawn. Um, oh, it was a work of art in its own way. But these days, if you get hold of comic books, they've got some very real, like, realistic details. There's a lot of efforts that these artists put now to bring the characters more alive and more given a human touch. So I guess I could appreciate the old school look to it. But at the same time, you know... It's not if you were to say this was the human torch um to me i would have I, I wouldn't know what you're talking about for me human torch was uh chris evans back in the uh original uh, fantastic four movies they were good at that time but obviously they're now very cheesy but either way guys we'll unbox this and we'll check it out and see how it looks and there we have it guys that's the original human torch on the 360 turntable so i'll zoom in over here just so you can get a bit more details over here just to see it like i said it's not there's not really much feature but one thing you would probably notice on my channel is the amount of difficulties that i have when it comes to balancing funko pops and this one you're not going to get that problem whatsoever especially if you look at the nice spot on flooring over there that is just pretty much sturdy so easy to display one other thing I would say is, I'll just bop his head over here. It's just nice and firm, honestly. If it, even though it is one of the cheapest pop items I have got, and for the value that you're paying for, you're getting a, a nice, steady, well-balanced uh, Funko Pop. So I can appreciate the effort that um, Funko has made into designing him. I would definitely think if, if you are a retro fan or even a Marvel fan, this is something that you might want to keep out in display. But either way, guys... Let me know in the comment section below what you reckon to the original Human Torch. Are you tempted to get in one? Is this something that you want to add on to your collection? Or do you just, in uh, general, want to share your other Marvel collection? Go ahead and comment below. I'll, I'll be sure to hit the like button. Anyway, guys, uh, once again, appreciate your time. I am going to be doing a competition, like I mentioned beforehand, uh, once I get up to 2,000 subscribers. I'll release a bit more details in the upcoming vids that I'm going to be doing in the later on this month. So if you are a fan of the channel, don't forget to hit the like button. It does support a small YouTuber like myself. And yeah, just come on board and subscribe. Don't Like I said, it would be great to see more people on board. Hopefully I'll be hitting that 2,000 very soon. But either way, guys, I'll be back with more Funko Pop vids next week. It has been your guy DJ Wacky. Enjoy the rest of your day. Peace out.